Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Uh, welcome to the LDM show. On today's show, I have Nematullah. Assalamu alaikum. How are you doing, bro? bro? How are you? I'm good. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. So, Nematullah, you're a uh, da'i. Uh, you go out there, you give da'wah. You know, you have a very successful Facebook page. So, you know, a lot of people, they know who you are. Alhamdulillah, you know. The name, you know, Nematullah is, is, is known around the da'wah circle. So, mm. one thing that people don't know about, how did you come to da'wah? How did you start giving da'wah? Yeah, Alhamdulillah, uh, the first time when I was start giving dawah, I didn't know a group or organization to teach me how to give dawah or train me. So I was thinking uh, to become a dai and give dawah to the non-Muslim. This was my dream. Hmm. Even I was dreaming if one day, I, if I can give one shahada to a non-Muslim, that would be my dream. It's, it would be complete, you know. But one day I went to Regent's Park, the Central Mosque, yes. Central London, Regent's Park, and I was praying there. I saw Brother uh, Sheikh Yusuf Chamber, the okay. speaker, Irish Inshallah. speaker, and he was sitting there. When I saw, I just ran to him. I said, <laughs> Sheikh, I'm looking for you. I've been looking for for you guys for many years. Where you? Where is your office? Where is your base? I want to become a dai. I want to join you. Can you just train me? Uh, you know, he was sitting talking to me, but he was just, you know, amazed, you know, and I was so amazed, I was shocked. I'm with, with the brother Yusuf Chamber, you know. Yusuf Chamber is yeah, right there in front right of me. Right there in front of me. So he just, you know, gave the number, he said, give me the number. I said, this is the number, right. IRA office number. And he said, uh, call to IRA office. Yes. He said, call to IRA office. This is the number. So he gave me the number, he said, call to our office tomorrow right. and you can join us. So I didn't know about Ayra that time, but right. I got the number. So I called uh, tomorrow morning to Ayra because it was a Sunday. I met him and Ayra office was closed. Okay. And then I called next morning to Ayra. So when I called to the Ayra office, one of the brother, you know, Brother Murtada, he okay. picked up the phone. Murtada, yes. And I told him, I want to give dawah. And what is the first step? Hmm. He said, come to the office. So I just run, you know, for, <laughs> I came to the office. I took the address. So when I came to the Ayra office, the first thing he gave me, he gave me, uh, 50 books. Wow, 50? 50. Uh, 50 books. Right. He said, this is the books, read and learn and give this book to the non-Muslim. I said, what is this book? The book was The Man in the Red Underpass. Ah, The Man in the Red Underpass. Yeah, written by Sheikh Abdurim Green. Inshallah. And he said, he took my email address, my number, he said, I will invite you for the first Dawah training course by Ayra. So, then after a few weeks, uh, he invited me to uh, one of the Ayra Dawah training course in Kingston, by Sheikh uh, Salim Chughatay. Oh, okay. So that was my first Dawah training course. Then when I done the Dawah training course, then I went to join the Kirban Dawah team in Kirban and started giving Dawah. Inshallah. Then, Alhamdulillah, Allah changed my life through Dawah, through Ayra. So Allah, Allah SWT brought Ayra in my life. Ayra trained me and I become a Dai. Then I start giving Dawah. Then from there, Alhamdulillah, I start uh, giving Dawah on Facebook. I start giving in, da in the street. Then I establish team, like I start Dawah tables in Slough, in wow. Hanslow, in Southall. Different, different Dawah tables. So, you, so you've gone out there and yeah. you've actually gone and set up actual Dawah tables the, yeah. in different locations. Different locations. Different teams. Exactly, yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. But I wanted to ask you, um, you know, you've explained uh, basically, you know, how you, you learn about Dawah, yeah. but... What motivated you to give Dao? Why did you want to give Dao? You know, well, what started you? You know, well, on the, this mission, basically. Well, the 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 main thing uh, was when I become Dai, mm, there was two things. The first thing uh, when I read the Quran, as Allah Subhanahu wa Taala mentioned many places in the Quran, yes. I came to uh, uh, to Surah Surah Imran when Allah says. Um, Tell to the, the, the Ahli Kitab, to the people of the book, the, the Jews and the Christian, come to similarities which is between you and me. Worship none but Allah. This verse, you know, it come in my mind as Allah is telling me to us Muslim, yes. tell to the Ahli Kitab, to the Jews and Christian, come to similarities, worship none but Allah. So this is telling me that I go and tell them. Yes. But I didn't have the key how to tell them. Okay. I didn't have the key. So the second thing was, oh, the Christian, you know, the Johanna Whitney's, other Christian, they were coming to my house, knocking my door every day, putting question against Islam, against Prophet Muslim, against his marriage, his life, and against Quran, contradiction, all this thing. 
and I was just You're shocked. getting upset. I, I was getting upset. I said, these people coming to my house, knocking my house, attacking my religion, attacking our prophet, attacking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and I'm just dead. I'm a dead person. You don't know what to say. I, I don't, you know, don't what know what to say. To respond. I didn't know how to respond. And I was looking, you know, that someone can train me to respond, to right. debate and to invite them. Wow. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala opened my way. And Alhamdulillah today, I'm a dai, Allah, Allah guide me, Allah give me the job of the prophets. Hmm. I'm... I'm the I'm best so job, lucky. Best the best job. job, the best job on the earth. If you want to be the best, give dawah, and that will make you the best. Alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, that's amazing. I just want to end the show. Basically, you know, you give a lot of dawah on Facebook. You know, you yeah. have a very popular Facebook page. Alhamdulillah. And you know, amazing things I've heard that you know you've you've um, you've spoken to people across the world and you've taken shahada from them. Yeah. And basically, you know, um, I want you to just give me a. Quick summary of one mm. of the stories you told me yeah. about this sister in China okay. because I think it's an amazing story yeah. for the viewers. Yeah. There is a sister in uh, uh, China in Taiwan. Yes. There's no Muslim in the town. Right. She contacted me on Facebook. Uh, she went to a Catholic uh, school, Catholic university and she got a degree in Christianity. Her family parents got church in Taiwan right. and she was a missionary. She contacted me on Facebook, sent me a message, asked me a question about Islam and Jesus al Islam. So I started giving dawah to her. Under discussion, she took shahada and became Muslim. Allahu Akbar. When she became Muslim, after that she changed her Facebook ID and her name, she became Aisha. Her name is Aisha. Mashallah. Then she, uh, she started giving dawah to her family. The, dawah, the family, the Christian family, the church, the priest, the father, the mother, the brother, they, they got upset. So she left the home and she got a separate so home. So she got kicked out. Yeah. And she moved, uh, she's working in Alhamdulillah in Taiwan, she got to other home, right. she got her, she, she, she can pay for her, her own self. She moved to other house and then she started giving dawah. So she started giving dawah to her boyfriend, her boyfriend became Muslim, he went oh, to Hajj oh, oh. and her neighbor, a Buddhist family, she invited the Buddhist family, they became Muslim and other Buddhist family in the China, in the uh, Taiwan. Many people became Muslim with her. So basically what you're saying is this, mm. you, you spoke to someone in China yeah. on Facebook, Facebook, not face to face. Yeah. They took shahada. Yeah. They learned how to give dawah. Yeah. And then now she gave dawah to, to other people in yeah. her vicinity, her yeah. neighbors, her boyfriend. Yeah. And now they become Muslim. Muslim. This just shows, you know, the power of social media. And she fasted the whole Ramadan. And she fasted the whole of Ramadan. Ramadan. And she prayed five times a day. And the people who took shahada, the Buddhists, she texts me in Fajr time that I am with them at Fajr time, teaching them Fajr pray. MashaAllah. Alhamdulillah. This is an amazing story. I just want to, you know, share that with the viewers out there. Yeah. Jazakallah khairan for coming. Oh, yeah, come. And inshallah, I'll see you outside in, during the dawah, inshallah. Inshallah, I will. Jazakallah khair. Assalamu alaykum wa barakatuh.